Alright, alright, right. hello, hello everyone, this isn't Soul Zero 17, you're letting me like usual. It's, I don't know, I made the picture, I did not made the pictures. I did not made the pictures, I made the thumbnail, I did not own the pictures though, and it's not fair to be Okay, so here's the thing, um, I just, I had to turn on freaking schoolwork and I was gonna make this video earlier in the day, but, <sighs> schoolwork just being a pain. Legit decoding again, like, it's just been that way and I'm tired of it. Illegit, I'm tired coding because I'm I get the first thing, but then I don't get like the second, third, fourth, fifth. Well I get the I think I got the second one right and then like the third, fourth, fifth. I don't understand it and it's just like it's all over my head and I try to figure out on my own. But it it, it doesn't seem like, like that, and I'm just had to start over on this one like ten times already because nothing was working right. I followed the video that they basically were doing a demo version of it, demo version of how things you could do, work on it, and it's just like didn't know how to, and I was like, okay, fudge. <sighs> I just I just got annoyed. With it. Um, they told me in the beginning of this whole entire college thing, the college school basically turned something into nothing. And that's what I did. I just did that. It wasn't even finished, I think. I couldn't even get it finished, that was the problem. So it was like all over the freaking place. And I just got so I legit have to take this class next, not the next, this month coming up next month, and it's just gonna be annoying. It's a one something, so let's just get this stuff done. Sorry for the whole entire rambling on. All right, this is why Naruto was Agnologia. So Sasuke is a girl in this one. Naruto has a sister. Minato is not going to get, you know. Minato is not going to be, like, forgiven. Nor is Nakura. But. Kushina. Well, that's going to be up in the air with you guys. As I said in the last video, as I remember, they were. They sent for the Chunin exams and they trained for a month. So let's go into this part. So this is what Naruto became, Agnologia. Also, I researched his, ma you know, see what type of magic can do. Or his magic type. It doesn't really matter, so... Different Dragon Slayer abilities are added. Yes, we're doing this. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, so... We're gonna just gonna get to the Shuni exams when they enter. So basically... Naruto, Sasuke, and, well, actually, you can't change your name. Yeah, so, and Sakura walk in. As, basically, Naruto just says, Oh, Sasuke, should we be calling you a different name? I mean, it legit just gets annoying, because I keep on imagining the whole entire boy thing when I say Sasuke. She goes, hmm... True. How about still Sasuke? You know, the, the whole entire like Sasuke, but it's like Sakuo? Sakuo, basically. It was, eh, that'll work for now. And, you know, so that just happens. So basically, everyone's like standing around. Naruto. Just looking. He's just thinking to himself. <sighs> How dumb are these people? Hmm. But if I use the Sharingan, I'll be able to detect that this is a Genjutsu or not. But that'd be too easy. Hmm. Yeah, maybe this would be too easy. As you know, Sasuke and Sakura come back, 
saying they got some information, and they just tell about the people there, and, like, what's, how long they've been waiting for, and it's just like, oh, this is a simple, easy trick, which, they're like, huh? What do you mean? He's like, Genjutsus. Sharingan. Sakura. And she goes, oh, right. So basically, Sharingan activates. And Genjutsu Sivra Fru. In which she just says, I can't believe we wasted so much time on this. And he was like, doesn't matter. I'm just gonna walk right up to him and smash it anyways. And when she was like, huh? What do you mean? Even Sakura's wondering. So, what Naruto does is he goes up to them and they're like, hey kid, what's up? He goes, nothing much, you scumbag of villagers. I mean, scumbag ninjas. <laughs> eh, nice little trick you got here. I mean, it's kind of easy to realize what this was. A little test already. So, listen, I made this a lot more easier for us, and a lot made more troublesome for you. So, here's the thing. As basically all of a sudden his hands on, not fire, but lights are on it, and then he just, well, he just punches the door, standing there flying off the hinges, and he's just smiling at this, and he goes like, Ah, now then. Hope you two have a nice day now. As he's just walking right through the door, he just busted open with his bare fist. Sako and Sakura are following after him. Basically, Sakura is saying, You really have to do that? He goes, Eh, it's fun. Basically, as the, the guys are just looking at each other and look at Naruto. Just being like, how? So, yeah. So, after that little fiasco, the whole entire fight with Lee will happen. Because of Naruto, actually. Because Lee wants to see how strong Naruto is. So, because he heard he's a dragon, and, well... I not heard. Oh, he didn't hear that. So he'd be like, he wants to see what this Naruto boy can do now, because he was able to sprout wings. So, a eh. so basically, the whole entire introductions to Lee happens, but instead of proposing or you know asking out Sakura, he goes Naruto Uzumaki, fight me. And basically gets into a fighting stance, and Naruto just shrugs. He goes, I got nothing against you, since I never saw you make fun of me or hurt me. So, I'll make this easy. No magic, no chakra, just pure brute strength. He goes, excellent, a Taijutsu battle it is then. Naruto just says, yep, pretty much. Come at me. Let's see if you can even lay out, make me even bleed a little. <laughs> As you know, Lee goes over and throws a punch kick. Naruto's just taking, tanking it. As he just says, hmm, not bad punches or kicks, solid. But here's the thing. Not enough speed. As Naruto disappears, but then Lee, Lee is sent flying. Like, I mean, sent flying. To the wall. Knocked out. In which. Naruto says. Uh, I think I overdid it. Maybe. <laughs> Yeesh. Sakura just goes. You idiot. <laughs> but you know. Sakuya. Oh. Jeez. Made my brain. Why did I forget this? Sako just kind of laughs at this. And which Naruto just says, Why are you laughing, Sako? 
Which she just says because I don't really like anyone thinks it can take you on. I mean, you did explain, and plus, you do have a Sharing gun now. I use, yeah, but still, it's only a tool. It's no point in using one if you don't need it. So, I mean, she just sighs, I mean, shrugs. Sakura's like, wait, you you have a Sharing gun? How? He was like, blood, able to, my body was able to make one. Doesn't mean I'm a Uchiha, it just means I'm able to have a Sharing gun now. Well, I mean, kind of does, but I think not. Eh. So, it's whatevs. So, anyways, let's go. And, well, they go into the pro well, you know, the test area, and then... Oh, that goes to cannon. Naruto just able to, well, try and cheat. Failing. But, A... What happens is, he does exactly, he just remembers, Sharingan, <laughs> yeah, then he just activates it, which, he just co copies everyone's answers, so everything goes similar to canon so far, until the entry into the, well, the whole entire Force of death. That part is different. So, Naruto does have to go to the bathroom. He does not get captured by snakes. Instead, he killed it with his bare hand, no magic or chakra. He just basically punched it, like uppercut it, and just took off the head. He's like, I forget sometimes how strong I am. But it did try to eat me. Eh. Whatever. So. He does go over to see Sakura and Sasuke. Seeing their version of himself. Well, Sakura, I mean. And, well, Aruch. You know, it's not, no, it's Aruch. Maru. But then to be Naruto as he goes. Oi. Snake. Next, if you're going to try to copy me. Also try to copy my sense of smell. It, you loser. And which... Suck... You know, Sucko just... Knows who... This is Naruto. So she launches a fireball jutsu at... You know... The fake one. In which... Well... Orochimaru dodges. And he just says, well... <laughs> It looks like I need to research up you more, Naruto Uzumaki. He goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you just call me Naruto, not the Uzumaki name? Or the Namikaze. I'm not a part of that family. Tch. In which, Orochimaru was surprised. It was like, the great four Kage should have been treating everyone with respect. He goes, just because I have a freaking demon fox inside of me, they legit have to treat me like a monster. Well, I became something more terrifying than a monster. A dragon. Snake. And if you want to live. As Naruto just emits this bloodlust and well, power, well, mostly killing her tent onto Orochimaru, which even he is scared of. Compared to Night Dales, you know, Edna Logia himself can one shot Karama. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering where's Karama, um, talking to Kushina right now, actually. So before we get into this epic fight, let's go over to Kushina and then, you know, Karama's perspective. Because I just want to. Well, Minato's out, her kids are out, she's home alone. Karama knocks on the door and be like, and when Kushina answered it, she was like, uh, uh, Kurama? He goes, hello, oh, Kushina. Do you mind if I come in? She goes, no, not at all. So he does, and, and well, he goes, so, how's everything going today? She goes, good. Why are you not with Naruto? He's like, oh, Naruto has everything under control. Besides, I had no logia with him. 
He's actually pretty strong. He's already stronger than me. Well, pretty stronger than me. But I'll be a lie. He is like way stronger. So, just a quick question. Do you have anything planned today besides, well, this? As he's talking about the house or missions. She goes, no, not at all. Why? How about me and you and hang out? Get to know it. Well, I mean, I know you enough, but you get to know me better. And you can just enjoy a good chat and talk. How about that? Which question I just uh, share. So, yeah. I was, I was basically going to... Well, get no get Kushina basically blushing a lot just because he wants to have fun and tease her so yeah so back over to the fight scene so basically Naruto well Orochimaru does show his true form Naruto launches himself at Orochimaru and then he basically roars a well he says Iron Dragon of War, basically. Because if you don't know, eat. What well, Agnolia eats is Ethan. Ethan or? Ethan or not? Whatever. It's a certain type of crystal that has all elements in it. So. That means I'm saying he can make. He doesn't have no specific type or element. So he can use any. And if he can eat any element, then why not make him use any element? So. Boom. Logic. Ish. Kind of. Reasoning. So yeah, basically, Aruchimaru dodges out of the way, but his arm was gone. He basically is thinking, what the? What sort of jutsu is this? As Naruto does, all of a sudden, does, multi, does his hand signs and says, multi shanakon jutsu! And, well, there's more than one of him, and they all just run at Aruchimaru. Aruchimaru, for, you know, does, you know, fire style, Fire Dragon Ball Jutsu, and the uh, Cologne grabs the, well, the ball of fire, and just starts eating it. In which Orochimaru goes, what? And, well, then that Cologne roar, you know, says, you know, basically, Roar of Dragon! Again, but it's a fire one this time. And, well, Orochimaru dodges it. The other Naruto's are basically at... Number tomorrow punches him, sent him flying to the other one, just punching him back over to that one that punched him. And it's like pinball, back and forth. Then all over. Basically, I wish tomorrow was not having a good day. So this goes on for a few minutes, and then until one of them kicks him up in the air, Naruto then goes up. Well, he just basically jumps up, grabs over tomorrow by the face, sprouts his wings. Flies up as high as he can to not kill Orochimaru yet, but then immediately dives down. In which Orochimaru is trying to scream, but since Naruto's hands covering his, it's hard to. And then when he gets near the ground, he slams Orochimaru into the ground, cracking it, making some of it come up. And then, well, he goes, <laughs> Alright, Snake. See you around. Also, thanks for your scroll. Because Orochimaru had a scroll on him that was not in canon. And they leave. Orochimaru just got his, well, slap. Shit slap, basically. Because <laughs> he couldn't do crap. If you're going to say, oh, how can I do that to Orochimaru? He's supposed to be so strong. Does it look like I care? Oh. I've seen a little bit of Agnologia's fights. This dude is strong <laughs> as heck. Or no, strong as hell. Basically, he can <laughs> he can basically slap Orochimaru across the face, has his head spin, and while that's happening, he can proceeds to punch him back into the ground multiple times over, grab him, does a Hulk thing, throws him in the air, and does a dry, you know, basically a roar. That will vaporize him. That's how much stronger I think he is. 
So yeah, don't come at me saying, oh, Ruchimar shouldn't have gotten his stuff again, like, you know, beat up so badly. He's lucky to be alive still. So yeah. But anyways, so after that, they don't see the sound ninjas that, you know, they would have met in canon. Sakura still has her long hair, and it's just, well, still useless. So, Sakuya is basically asking him questions, saying, How are you able to, you know, defeat him so easily? I'm like, wasn't he, like, um, Orochimaru Asanin? As she says, questioning, he goes like, yeah, one to three. It's easy. Dragon speed plus dragon strength, magic and chakra enhancing. Kind of comes in handy when you have two different types. Chakra and magic. And magic. He goes, oh, well, I mean, I don't know any enhancing magic, but hey. I know fire magic. Actually, I know any type of elemental magic that's based off of dragons. Wait. There's a sky dragon that has healing. And enhancements. And buffs. I could just use them and end the fight even quicker. I'm such an idiot. In which... Well... <laughs> Sakura's looking at him along with Sakura. But yeah, I just feel like... Tell us something we don't know. He just looks at both and be like, I don't love any one of you. Which kind of, like, Sakura doesn't care, but, you know, Sakura was about to cry. He goes, that's a lie. I only care about one. And it ain't you, pink-haired banshee. Which Sakura looks at Naruto and he goes like, do you? And he goes, yes, I care about you. Don't cry. She smiles and Sakura's like, don't ever call me a... And then she thinks about it before she does anything. She thinks about what Naruto did to Orochimaru. She just zips her lips and he goes like, I thought so. <laughs> so they get over to the places that they do in canon. Very, like a day early. And well, you know, they open up the scrolls Kakashi. So... Uh, he says, wow, you guys are the first ones here. Great job, guys. <laughs> He's like, thanks. Anyways, I'm going to go train. Sa Sakura, you want to come? She nods. And Sakura says, I'm going to go train too. See ya. As Kakashi's kind of impressed by that. Well, with Sakura and you know, Naruto's training, Naruto's able to get the third Tomoe. Sakura also... Basically, they keep fighting, and, well, he's learned some fireball jutsus, you know, well, learned a fireball technique from her. He's also learned some different jutsus. And plus, I mean, if he think, I mean, he can eat any chakra element. I mean, he can actually use any chakra element, too. So, he's gonna ask the old man, well, he's gonna ask Third Hokage if he has any, like, you know, where I'm supposing, like, chakra, well, jutsus, basically. Ooh, elemental jutsus. So lightning, wind, water, and earth. He doesn't know. So, get a drink, everyone. Hold on. So yeah. So basically, after a couple hours of training, Sakura was just saying, "Okay, we really gotta think of a better name for me." And he was like, "Yeah, no crap." Anyways, what do you think? We're you know, what do you want to think about it so much? I was like, "Well, I want to have like a cute name." She says, and he was like, "Of course." And before they even talk, Donzo comes out and nowhere. He goes like, Naruto, I saw what you, well, not saw, but I had some Anbu follow you. 
into the air. And we saw, they told me what you did. Very impressive to defeat Orochimaru. It's like, so, did you even get the snake? Because unfortunately, he slithered away. So, no. It's like, I finally knocked him out long enough for you guys to. Jeez, that snake is very slippery. And anyways, what are you here for? It's like, well, <laughs> I would say you don't have to take this, but knowing you, you want to see what your the future gendings of this village can do, so you'll probably just stay. He was like, yeah, plus it'd be too freaking easy if I just went out. But anyways, can you just tell him go? Not trying to be rude here, just trying to think of a name for this girl. That's proper, so. Yeah. Which of Donjo kind of just chuckles. He goes like, here. As he basically just show, gives him all these scrolls. He's like, eh, eh, chakra control, elemental scrolls, and, huh. Basically also how to... Use Uzumaki chains and sealing the scrolls. How the he goes? I may or may not have had some Anbu to copy the whole entire Uzumaki's sealing seals and how to use chakra chains. And he goes, "Oh, this is gonna be fun now." <laughs> yeah. Uh. Thank you, Donzo. You made this so much more easier for me to destroy my family. Which Donzo, Donzo just bows and says, Good day, Naruto. As he body flickers away. And when she goes, uh, uh, You're gonna be overpowered. He was like, I'm already am. But anyways. As he makes, he says, Multi shadow kontitsu. After doing the hand signs. 2,000, what, 5,000. He goes, Alright. Here, guys, here's the scrolls. Learn them multiple times, and after you're done learning them, poof, you know, that's a nod. And so he goes, like, All right, now let's think of a name for you. And they talk about it for at least a good hour or so. He's like, ah, Come on, can't even think of one. I guess Sako is just the one you can have the key for now. Go back to Sasuke. She goes, No, 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 let's, let's, you know, keep talking about it. He's like, all right. So, yeah, they just keep on talking about it. It's like try to keep it some, so somewhat similar to her name, but not really. And well, they just sigh because they couldn't think of any more. So, you know, cycle is for right now. Anyways, Gar was the, you know, and his team was the other ones there. So basically, everything else goes to canon, and the training is better in this one. So no, Sakura has basically been training herself in this one now because of one reason. Naruto is overpowered, and she wants to do stuff, try to prove herself. Because of Stone Denial, so, you know, for Sasuke. But, you know, girl, so, eh. Anyways. Hmm. What happens is after a couple of, you know, basically like I said, a couple of days, it's time for the well not preliminaries, but just to actually get people like shrunk down to numbers because there's too many people. So when Minato arrives, he was like, Hello there everyone. It is basically about to start a competition, a fight now, not a competition, a fight between amongst all of you. Yeah, a fight amongst all of you. Because we've got too many people here. So, at random, this will be chosen to be, you know, your opponent. So, I hope, just, you know, just fight and, well, please don't kill no one right now. Be a lot more easier. In which people just shrug and be like, all right. So, yeah. Anyways. 
So, some fights are different, but, like, Naruto's not going to be versing Kiba. That's Manma. I mean, not Manma, that's, that may be Nakura. Hmm. Yeah, why not Nakura? So, basically, the first match is Nakura versus Kiba. Kiba loses. Then it's basically something similar to everything. But in this one, the fight with Naruto is. Mm. Oh, yeah, Sakura got double. Sakura beat Eno you know, because no KO because she trained more. She trained a little bit. So, yeah, she improved a little bit more. That's how she won. Anyways, Naruto's gonna fight. Hmm. Sound ninjas didn't go well, so basically, he's gonna fight one of the sound ninjas. But for some reason, there's two, because I even forgot to mention Minato saying there will be sometimes two people fighting, or all three. So we apologize to you, but you know, that's how it's gonna be to you know, get this down. You know, bring the amount of people down to you know, get in the preliminaries. So, yeah. In other words, Naruto just faces both of the sound ninjas. Hmm. Wait. And they were already taken down. Never mind. Wait, actually, let's just say random people. Like, a group of random people. All three of them. Not two. And then he just smiles and goes like, alright, let's do this. Because Naruto basically just jumps down and... Well... These ninjas jump down to the arena, well, area where they're fighting. And he was like, <laughs> look at him. One versus three. It's going to be too easy. As no other just sighs and goes like, and look, cocky. All right. Guess it's time for me just to hold back now. As they're like, what? So basically, they tried to attack Naruto. But they lose miserably. Like one gets thrown to the wall, another one gets slammed his face into the ground, and just another one just, just basically gets smacked around. Like, wow, just smack around like a soccer ball or a pinball. So yeah. Anyways, Naruto. After doing that, he just sighs and says, Not many strong people here. Alright, whatever. And that surprised everyone because it was just one sided. No one knows the true strength of Naruto, so they were hoping for him to at least struggle so they get to see. But no, he did not. So, anyways, so after that. Some people do have to, f the whole entire fit fight with Gara happens, similar, the whole, even the whole entire fight with Hanata, Naruto just basically for shooting out a laser at, you know, Neji, that was it, he just told him back off, Hyuga, in which, well, Neji does. So yeah. Anyways, so, after, how can I say this right, okay, so after that, then the whole entire thing of exam is, I mean, the fighting's over, so they tell him to do a train for one month, and, well, Naruto then deactivates the clones, because they were, you know, he did say, even though he made like 5,000, they knew what to do else. Same thing like in canon. I mean, not in canon, same thing like they always do. Train and train and train and everything. So, the ones who read the, the scrolls just then gave it to another Naruto. Basically, it did take a while. So, or actually, one of them gave the scrolls. 
and then just gave it to another one, another one, as they just said, copy us, and that was it, and which, yeah, that's how that went, so after I poofed them all, it was like only like 10 more left, and they were like about to poof themselves, one by one, step like slowly, it was already like too late, so basically, they poofed, he got the information, he was like, huh, so they mastered all of them, cool, which, you know, Sakura was very surprised, because they took, like, way long, and he basically just says, ah, he made it hard for them, he gave them less chakra than usual, in which he was surprised, so, Kuhashi overhearing this, was like, going, huh, what do you mean, he's like, oh, Donzo gave me some scrolls, so, you know, so, I mean, it was basically just gave them through the shackles, they did the work. But, you, you know, that's all. In which, well, okay. oh, she was like, <laughs> that's kind of using the shackle technique. He was like, hey, it's not my fault they, well, not the multi shackle technique. He goes, it's not my fault they, uh, how can I say this right? They relay back information told you. I mean, it's basically, that's how you get to be over, like, to get so strong and overpowered. I mean, yeah, I forgot he became a seal master because of this, too. So, yeah. And then he was like, anyways, I'm gonna go home for now and rest. Ugh, I'm bored. But, Sakuno, so, just... Goes over and says, can we hang out, though? It's like, fine. Let me guess, a date? She goes, mm-hmm. It's like, okay, okay. Hey, Kakashi, if you're going to train, you know, her, let me know. So, I mean, I can plan something else to do. All right. Kakashi nods. So, they go on a little date, barbecue. They eat. Hold on. Like I was saying, they went on a little date. And afterwards, Naruto does ask her, So, are we a thing? Or are we just friends just dating? You know, see how we like each other? I mean, she does blush and saying, Sure, we can. And he's like, Okay. So, you know, he does. They're walking, so he does stop and. Looks at her. She stops and looks at him. He pulls her closer and just kisses her. She blushes and he goes like, "I'm happy." All right, let's get back to her nice place. She nods and they. When well, she walks, when they get there, they see something very weird even for Naruto. He goes, "Grandma, I'm back." Karama and Kushina are basically cuddling on the couch. He goes, Naruto, my boy, what's up? He was like, you're... No. No. He was like, he smiles and he goes, no. He goes, what? You can't be. Yes, I am. I mean... <laughs> I told myself Minotoshin, you know, he lost her already. And I was right. He did. You know, Kushin is just like sleeping though and cuddling with his Karama. He's like, I mean, Naruto's like, just anyone but her. But fine, you do you. And then he looks at, you know, Sa Sako. He goes, like, So you date her? He nods and he goes, like, Congrats. You know, basically. Current eye is going to be back, he says. Um, she knows about me and her. And, yeah. It's perfectly fine with her. It was really, really, yep. He goes, all right, whatever you say, Karama. So, yeah. So, after well, that little thing... He basically says, I'm gonna need a lot and a lot and a lot of self control 
not to yell at her. You know, Sako laughs a little bit, like, I know you can do it. Kisses him on the cheek. It's like, thanks. So, yeah, so basically, for those facing it all day, they just talked, hang out. Guess if she was having done with it. The next day was just something else, like, the same thing, hot springs and Jiraiya. So, he trains with Jiraiya. Jiraiya heard about Naruto. He's, well, if you're wondering, would he be, you know, going to Nakura? No, he heard about Nakura. He does not want to go to her. He just wants to train Naruto, and that's it. Boom. Also, like, Minotaur already had him trained her. So, it's like, hey, you heard about my grand my godson is a, has a new power. I want to see it. So, he sees it. He sees Naruto. He doesn't believe it. He asks questions. He tells Naruto, just tells him. He's like, okay, great. So here's the thing. I want to teach you some jutsus. So. He told somebody. Wrestling on. And. Well. Help you out to even improve the wrestling on too. And he was like, huh? Okay, don't know what you mean by that, but fine. Kakashi did take Sakura and well, she learns the Shidori. If you're worried about, you know, the whole tire, uh, Orochimaru gonna try to take her. No, because Orochimaru doesn't want, he doesn't want to lose his life. He doesn't care, he doesn't, he cares about the eyes, yes, but he, he'll do it when Naruto's not around. Try to get her to her, his side, basically. But it's like, no, 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 don't attack one of the boys around. So, yes. So, that happens, and which is the most funniest thing ever, because Daraya is always trying to outrun Naruto, because he wants to do his research, and Naruto won't let him. And so, <laughs> that happens a lot. But anyways. He... Basically learns the wrestling on. He you know does get the toad summoning. He actually improved on the wrestling on to make the real wrestling shuriken. But he does say it's gonna be a little bit too early to use this. He has to work on it more more basically. And well, which Jiraiya agrees, but he's impressed with Naruto. So he asks him what level of steel are you are. Tells Naruto level and he just helps right and become a level ten. Wait, I think Naruto was right. I'm not Naruto. Jiraiya was level ten. So let's say they make their own level eleven <laughs> together. So yeah. So at the end of the well, at the start of the Chunin exams, it's the same fight. Neji versus Naruto. And all Naruto is gonna do is just say wind magic <laughs> increase speed basically he buffs himself and then almost suddenly and then Mount Crotter says begin Naruto just blitzes Neji Neji tries to go for his chakra points but when as soon as his hand, you know, fingers basically poked Naruto, it just it was like he was hitting bricks. So Naruto infused his hand on his fist with chakra, added a little bit of fire element to it, and punches him so hard he's gonna flying over to the wall and have him indented. So yes, Naruto basically did that to Neji. And so what happens is, um, everything else goes similar. Sakura will lose this, but, you know, they did a pretty decent job. And Kikashi and Sakura are late. And this is going to be, not the end of it, but, you know. So the whole entire guard leaving, rampaging does happen. And well, Naruto basically goes after him. He tells Sakura to stay here, help out the villagers. He'll take care of this. She doesn't want to, but 
Well, he just tells her he's going to go in dragon form. And she's like, oh, okay, never mind. Have fun. Be safe, sweetie. She kisses him on the cheek and she just leaves. In which Naruto falls Garo into the woods. He takes out Gonkuro, then Tamari. And basically when it's just Gara, he tells him to go in full power. He'll kill I mean, if he doesn't, he'll just kill him. Which, Shikaku comes out and, lo and behold, you know, Agnologia form, dragon, in which Shikaku's like, ah, he goes, run, run, sand demon, as, well, Shikaku runs away, well, tries to. Naruto flies towards him, grabbing him, slamming Shikaku in the ground. Basically, throwing him around like a ragdoll. Basically, even shoots out a blast that destroys Shikaku, and that destroys Gara, which Naruto then immediately switches back to the human form, but just with the wings out just to catch, you know, Gara. After him asking him why. You know, why did you save me and why are you protecting the village? He just says because one, he met some really good people, and two, he's not gonna let someone like him ruin his life just because of, well, you lost control of yourself because of a stupid tanuki. In which Shikaku's like passed out, but he's angry. So yeah, he does, and he basically gives him talking no jutsu. Garo would do what he does in canon. Tamari and Konkuro come over and get him. He they leave. Naruto just runs back, and he helps with the having the people leave. Um, he does see. Oh, well, he does smell like someone's near death, or going to be. No, 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 no. He asks where is Lord Third, and they just tell him, and he just runs. He does see the barrier. He does like see that there's a sword about to go into the Lord. I mean, to her reason, Naruto grabs his fist, and well, not grab. He basically clenches his fist, and throws a punch with full force, everything he has into it, shattering it, and basically then telling. You know, basically Orochimaru to scram as Orochimaru runs because of, well, he nearly died to Naruto. So, yeah, he runs with the sound ninja four and Haruzan thanked him. And with Naruto's help at the village. Villagers are coming to respect Naruto, but he doesn't care about them. Kurenai is happy that, you know, Naruto did so well. She was proud of him. Basically, he's like this. Kurenai just says, Naruto, I'm so proud of you. I mean, you passed. I mean, basically, he was like, no. Much then Naruto replies, yeah, but no one was strong enough. But, well, the Garo kid was strong, but, yeah. <sighs> took it too seriously so yeah anyways Kurama is like congratulating him because he knows he's gonna a tuning Krishna is there just well just basically says to Naruto hi and sorry well they talk and she does congratulate him he says he'll forget he'll, he'll not forget but he'll try to forgive. She nods though in understanding, which, well, yeah. So, Naruto, after a couple of days pass, Naruto is called, and, well, along with many others, well, not many, but, with other people like Shikamaru and Sakuo. Basically, Minato says, 
I'm going to promote to two of you to Chunin's and one of you to low Jonin rank. In which Naruto was like, oh, thanks. Which Shikamaru says, I already knew Naruto was going to get it, but Sako just wants to make sure. He goes like, is it Naruto as Yamato nods? So they're Chunin, he's Jonin. He says, congratulations to everyone. And yeah. But anyways, I'm sorry about this, guys, but I'm going to go. I need to get some sleep. Tomorrow, I got to study for a test. So yeah, bye, everyone. Have a nice night, day, wherever you are. It's not a cliffhanger, no jutsu. Just, you know, or any cliffhanger. This is like, after that, they're just going to go get some naughty, and I can save that till like another time. So yeah, bye, everyone.